Hello everyone, welcome to Yellow Pages Nursing. Today's topic is about injection or adrenaline drug calculation for nurses. Before entering into the topic, if you have not subscribed our channel, please subscribe our channel. Let's get into the session. Injection or adrenaline or norepinephrine is an organic chemical of the catecholamine family and it comes under the drug class alpha or beta adrenergic agonists. Some of the common indications of using noradrenaline will be septic shock, cardiogenic shock, cardiopulmonary resuscitation, hypotension, etc. Noradrenaline comes in ampule form with one ampule containing 2 ml which equals 4 mg. The available dose will be as per the label. Injection noradrenaline, one ampule contains 2 ml which equals 4 mg. Each ampule contains noradrenaline 2 mg in 2 ml, but the label presents as 4 mg of noradrenaline acid tartrate in 2 ml. And the exact amount of noradrenaline in a 2 ml ampule will be 2 mg. When you have a look at this picture, the label circles here 2 ml containing 4 mg. And the underlying area explains that each ml or 1 ml consists of noradrenaline by tartrate 2 mg equivalent to noradrenaline 1 mg and hence noradrenaline 2 ml equals 2 mg. So the important thing we learn from this is injection noradrenaline 1 ampule contains 2 ml equivalent to 2 mg of noradrenaline. Looking into the concentration for single and double strength infusions. For single strength, we take 2 ampules of noradrenaline containing 4 mg and the dilutant will be 50 ml of sodium chloride and hence the final concentration is 80 microgram per ml. For double strength, we take 4 ampules of noradrenaline containing 8 mg. The dilutant solution will be 50 ml of sodium chloride and hence the final concentration is 160 microgram per ml. Now, doctor's prescription for noradrenaline infusion is injection noradrenaline 2 microgram per minute. How do we do this? All we need is a syringe from a PM line, a 50 ml syringe and solution for dilution. The other compatible solution other than sodium chloride will be dextrose 5%. A very important thing is the presence of a central venous access line before starting the infusion of injection or adrenaline. The formula goes desired dose multiplied by quantity multiplied by time and minutes divided by available dose multiplied by thousand which gives ml per hour. Applying the example using single strength, we take two ampules containing 4 ml equaling 4 mg of noradrenaline which becomes the available dose. As per the formula, desired dose will be 2, quantity will be 50, that is 46 ml of normal saline plus 4 ml of noradrenaline, time in minutes will be 60, available dose will be 4. And applying all, we get the answer 1.5 ml per hour. Now, using the example for double strength, we take 4 ampules of noradrenaline containing 8 ml and it equals 8 mg of noradrenaline which becomes the available dose. As per the formula, desired dose will be 2, quantity will be 50 that is 42 ml of normal saline plus 8 ml of noradrenaline, time and minutes will be 60 and the available dose is 8. Applying all, we get the answer 0.75 ml per hour. Here you go with injection or adrenaline drug calculation using a syringe pump. If you find this video useful, please like it and please subscribe it. And do not forget to hit the bell icon. Thanks for watching and have a nice day.